Hello. Good afternoon to you all. You are welcome to Creative Arts Virtual Class. Creative Arts is the integration of visual arts and performing arts. Strands. We'll talk about visual arts and performing arts. Introduction Visual Arts What are visual arts? Visual arts are art forms such as painting, drawing, print making, sculpture, architecture, ceramics, and etc. All these art forms are visual art forms. They are artworks that can be seen and touched. Performing Arts Performing Arts refers to forms of activity that are performed in front of an audience. So normally performing arts are performed on stage in form in front of an audience examples are drama dance music poetry and etc so there are many other forms of performing arts Who is a visual artist? This is a great question. A visual artist is a person who creates visual artworks such as ceramics, drawing, painting, sculpture, printmaking, photography, and etc. Who is a performing artist? A performing artist is an entertainer or a person who performs dramatic or musical works for an audience. So we're going to have discussions about some visual, Ghanaian visual artists. The first person to talk about is Abladi Glover. Country of origin, he comes from Ghana. He was born in 1934. Training. He was trained through formal education. He was trained through formal education. Specialization. So his area of specialization in creative art is painting. So he does more of painting works. Title of some works. He created a work called Market Scene. Another one is Lorry Station and etc. We will have time to look at samples of his work later in our next lesson. 
exhibitions. Exhibition talks about um, showcasing your artworks. Showcasing your artwork. How would people get to know about your artworks? You have to display your artworks for the public to see. That is exhibitions. And Abladi Glover shows or showcase his artworks at National Gallery of Modern Art Lagos in Nigeria. So if you go to this gallery, you will see a lot of Abladi Glover's artworks there. This is the man we are talking about, Abladi Glover. The next person to talk about is Amon Kotei. I hope the name sounds familiar. Country of origin, Ghana. He was born May 24, 1915 in Accra. Training. He was trained through formal education. So he was once a student like you. Specialization. His area of specialization is sculpture, painting, and music. So he does sculptural works. He can paint and he can also compose music. Title of some works. Coat of Arms of Ghana. And I believe we all know the Coat of Arms of Ghana. So this was designed by this man. That's the picture on your screen. Amon Kote. The next person to talk about is Betty Aqua. Country of origin, Ghana. Born March 20, 1965. From Cape Coast. She was trained through formal education. So she was once a student like you. Area of specialization. And he does more of oil painting works. Oil painting works. So she is a painter as well. Title of some works. One of her works is Joy and Harmony. This is the woman we are talking about. So art is not only for the boys or for the men. The girls and ladies, you can also take part in creative arts. The next person to talk about is Ibrahim Mahama. And then we also have Ato Delacruz. We have Kofi Antubam. All these people are all visual artists. We have Kwame Amwa, Theodosia Foko, which we will talk about her in our next class. We will talk about this woman very well. We also have Uku Ampofu and Ofe Nyako. They are all visual artists. And last but not the least is E.L. Anachi and etc. So we have a lot of them. You can also search through the internet to get information on these um, visual artists shown on the screen. Try as much to do it, please.
Let's also look at some Ghanaian performing artists. We will first talk about Dr. Ephraim Amu, country of origin, Ghana, born September 13, 1899. Wow. Training. He, he had his training in Royal College of Music. So this can even tell you this man is a musician. Area of specialization is music composition. Music composition. So he is a musician. Title of some works. Yang Ara Assassini. And then I know this work is sung everywhere in Ghana, Ghana schools. We go for assembly and when we sing Yang Ara Assassini, this song was composed by this great man, Dr. Ephraim Amu. That's the man, Dr. Ephraim Amu. He's a great composer. The next person to talk about performing artist is Grace Omabo, no, who is known as Mame Dokono. Yeah, it sounds funny, but that, that's the, the name most people used to call her, Mame Dokono. Country of origin, Ghana, born June 19, 1946. Training. She was trained through formal education, just as you are doing now. Specialization. Acting. So she is an actress. Title of some works. By the Fireside and Obra Drama. So you will see... Uh, Grace Omabo in these shows by the fireside, which is no more shown on televisions, and then Obra. This is the woman we are talking about. Yeah, this is Mamed Okono. The next is Felicity Ama. Ajiman. In fact, this name is not familiar at all. Felicity Ama Ajiman, who is known as Nana Ama Mac Brown. That's the name uh, everybody knows. But for her actual name, Felicity Ama Ajiman, we, we don't know it much. Country of origin, Ghana. Born, August 15. 1973 training she attended james madison university college of business and then area of specialization is acting so this woman is an actress title of some works so she was featured in these works my own mother my own mother i think it's a movie and then mark brown kitchen yes so this is the woman we are talking about this is nana ama mark brown and then the actual name is felicity ama ajiman We will also talk about Charles Ni Ama Mensa Jr., who is known as Shatawale. I know he will be the favorite for some of you. Country of origin, Ghana. Born 
October 17, 1984. He attended Weniba Secondary School. Area of Specialization He is a songwriter and a singer. He is a songwriter and a singer. Title of some works My Level Ayo Melissa and etc. I think we have a lot of music composed or created by this guy. Niyama Mensa Jr. Shatawali. So that's the guy we are talking about. Shatawali. And he is a performing artist. The rest are Akwesi Ampofu Ejei, Kwebju Inkansa Lewin. I hope you know you know them. Livingston Echi Satikla Satikla who is known as Stone Boy. I think that's a real name of Stone Boy. Mm, yeah. Then we have Michael Owusu Ado, who is known as Sakodie. Samuel Edufrem Pong, who is also known as Medical. And we have Wendy Ado, known as Wendy Shea. You can also search for the information of these artists from the internet. And I will encourage you to do so. Do you have any idea who designed the Ghana flag? And then the second one is who composed the Ghana national anthem? That's a question for us all. We will have a discussion on it in our next class. So try to find out who the designer of the flag is and then the composer of the national anthem we'll meet next time try to go over the slides again read well create your own notes and then you can go back to the portal page on the dashboard